Hello and good evening. The fans are in full voice tonight as the players come out onto the pitch. In position next to me is Trevor Brookie. Thank you, Peter. I've been doing all my homework on these two sides, which I'll be talking about very soon. Anyway, let's get going. You really can sense there's plenty of passion here between the two sets of players. So let's hope both teams will thrill us with an excellent display of football today. We're off, and this is a contest sure to please football fans worldwide. Both teams will be aiming to keep it tight in the early stages. Down the left flank. Here's the opportunity for a ball in to open the score. This looks like a promising cross. Tied it up by the keeper. Well worked to win the ball. The defenders are constantly on the back foot. Chance in the box. Fifteen minutes gone in the first half. Is there space for a shot? Oh, it's in. That's the under. Really was a super shot into the left corner. So the goal has pleased a huge number of fans in the stadium. Let's listen to them. What did you make of the goal, Trevor? Four marks from the finish, but for me it was the pass which split the deep. Take the lead, but this is always a dangerous time. I have to keep the wits about them. Looking around for support. A good ball in could give them another goal here. Raul! A magnificent goal! They stretch their lead to two goals. A super shot, what a beauty! the cushion they needed, so perhaps they'll take their foot off the throttle a bit now and we'll see them defend a bit deeper and attack this lead. It was a superb ball. They now have a two-goal cushion at 2-0. Looking for support now. Almost 30 minutes gone. No, the referee has pulled play back here. You have to say that was a late call there. They intercept the pass. Well read. The defence needs to be tight on their man here. The keep is under pressure. It's clear. Win possession here. Can anyone stop him? Into the box. And it's in the net. Goal! This is their advantage. Just before the break. A beautiful right foot finish. They've looked very comfortable since scoring the second. And it wouldn't surprise me if we see even more goals. Right, Trevor, it's 3-0 and they are looking good. <laughs> Boop. Boop. 
3-0 now, a handsome lead developing. There'll be two additional minutes. Extremely important interception there. The whistle goes for half-time and the players head off to the dressing rooms with the managers, no doubt, having plenty to say during the break. So, Trevor, what's your take on the game so far? That was a very positive half there for them. They've really put the pressure on and the results are showing. Well, one team providing us with three goals in the first half, it's 3-0. We begin the second half. How will the teams respond to their manager's half-time team talks? They've switched sides for the second half. Attack came to nothing. Down the right flank. Dashes along the right flank. He needs to deliver a good ball in. Well, he didn't catch it, but he did make it safe by punching it out of play. It's into the face of goal. Astonishing goal! They might just run away with this. Ten minutes played in the second half. It's a tremendous header. That just underlined the quality of their attack. It's 4-0, they've been on fire in front of goal today. Held on to the ball there. 15 minutes of the second half gone. We've got to make a good pass here, otherwise the advantage will be lost. Fernando Torres. Villa. He pounces on the rebound. Oh, just no accuracy of the shot there. This is their final substitution of the game here. This is a substitution, surely, that underlines their intentions just to defend this lead. Down the middle. The through ball sets up the attack. He lifts it into the box. Good clearance. That's predictable. The ball is still with them here. Well, the through ball is not good enough. The danger's gone. Well won there. So, it's an attack on the right. Villa! 
not a bad effort, but it wasn't on target. And Vila. Nicely won there. The attack came to nothing. He's on the rampage. Wins the ball, great defending. The ref ends the game, and a huge roar from the crowd. This was a one-sided game, and they've come away with an easy win. Would you say the game went to plan, Trevor? More or less, yes. They have a couple of things to work on, though. That's it for tonight's match. So it just remains for me, Peter Bratty, to thank Trevor Brooking beside me. Oh, it's been a great night, Peter. And we hope to see you for the next broadcast. Goodbye. Thank <laughs> you.